This video outlines how the thermal conductivity sensor within the Panther works. Two microthermistor beads are housed in a temperature-stable block that remains at ambient temperature. Both microthermistor beads are powered, so generate heat, which dissipates through an air gap to the block, at a constant rate. The reference bead simply compensates for changes in ambient temperature, so helps reduce sensor drift. When a gas that is different to air passes between the sensor bead and thermal block, the rate at which the heat transfers from the bead to the thermal block changes. It is this change in temperature and the resulting change in the thermistor's resistance that is measured and converted to a leak rate. Some gases are more thermally conductive to air and others are less conductive. This means the sensor can experience a negative or positive response, depending on the gas. That said, to avoid confusion, the default setting on the Panther displays all readings as positive. For more information, subscribe or go to ionscience.com.